Hello everyone, welcome back to Lina's Kitchen. Today I will share with you our easy homemade bread. Algeria is rich in many types of bread. Today I will share with you one of the easiest Algerian bread recipe, Essumulina bread. For this recipe we will need 2 cups of warm water, 3 tablespoons of instant yeast, sumulina. In a bowl, mix 1 cup of sumulina with 2 cups of warm water. Add 3 tablespoons of instant yeast. I melted 1 tablespoon of sugar in the second cup of water and add it to my mixture. Add black seeds, mix everything well, cover it with plastic wrap and let it proof for about 30 minutes. After proofing 30 minutes, add 1 of 4 cups of oil, 2 teaspoons of salt, 3 cups of flour. Knead your dough so that it forms small bubbles, and you can knead it with an electric mixer. Knead it for about 15 to 20 minutes. After kneading it well, put your dough back in the bowl and let it proof for about 30 minutes. After proofing 30 minutes, now you can make your bread balls. Divide your dough into four equal pieces. Make small balls. Knead them until you form smooth balls. Dip your bread balls in oil, then in sumulina, both sides. When you put the bread on the tray, open the bread well, so that your bread is not heavy and coarse. Continue like this until you have completed all the quantity. When you put your bread balls in your tray, always flatten your bread balls, so that your bread is not heavy and coarse. After putting your bread in your tray, cover it and let it proof for about 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, your bread will double its volume. Now it's time to bake our bread. Bake your bread at 400 Fahrenheit for about 15 minutes on the bottom. When your bread become golden brown on the bottom, turn your oven off and turn it on on the top and bake your bread on the top for about 10 to 15 minutes until it becomes golden brown on the top. After taking out your bread from the oven, take out the excess of semolina with a brush. My bread is a crunchy outside, fluffy and tender inside. Look at my bread inside, there's a lot of bubbles, it means I worked my bread very well. I hope my video is helpful and you will try this recipe. Please like, share and subscribe for more. See you in the next video. Bye!